shit, I can't, I really don't know. Well, I can give you a British slang and you can guess what it means. Okay, sure. Uh, have you ever heard of a bellend? A bellend? Yeah, it, it, it's, it's rude. It's meant to be an install. Oh, really? I thought it would be yeah. like some household item or near like or like a <laughs> no, roof piece it, or it's something. something you call someone you, it's something you call someone that you don't like someone like a bell end I don't <laughs> well, I really let me look this up do you want to have a guess I don't know okay um it's basically the end of the penis it's kind of shaped like a bell uh, oh oh so, so it's, yeah, so we call people a bellend. I calling them a knob, like a cock. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're we're really posh, sophisticated people. Okay, Shakespeare. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Why are you in here? Ooh, top has uh, you know, Do you know what knackered means? Knackered? Yeah. I've K -N -A -C -K -E -R -E -D. Yeah, I've heard of it. Yeah, you know what it means. Not off the top of my head. I have a guess. Like confused or something? Uh, not quite. Uh, completely taking the chance as a new weapon, but it's not quite bowy enough. Huh. Gotta remember, um... Yeah, actually, now I remember, um... Like if I know what knackered is. It means tired. Oh. Like exhausted or took it out. Like me every You're goddamn knackered. day. Yeah. Did you realize I was in my stomach until just now, right? Yuck. Oh god. Please don't. Don't. Uh, don't. Icky. Please. Don't want. Oh, here we go. I didn't say anything. A small plate of window glass lies in the bottom of the empty box. Alas, another unexpected chest pain. What? I don't know. <clears throat> Anyways, now that um, being in this little cell area reminds me of this one time that we tried to attempt uh, this sort of uh, Final Fantasy D&D &D thing. Um, or Final Fantasy Pathfinder. But we were, um... Yeah, we were like using the characters in the... Uh, Final Fantasy thing, but I still ended up playing as a cat character because they allowed it. And I thought it would be pretty cool to do so. Especially because plot-wise, or not, yeah, like plot-wise, um, male feline characters in that game, or in that uh, area, or whatever, um, are technically not uh, seen out in broad daylight because they're kept inside the, the caves that uh, their kind live in. And thing is, is because there's not as many guys as there are girls, so you can probably where, see where I'm getting at with this. You you played as a male female character. I I played as a male character who managed to escape uh, his homeland because he wanted to see the outside world and not live just inside. Right. Causing a terrible and, time. And, with it, was damage a, across and it was a feline male. He has a feline, or like a feline kind person, or whatever. Yeah, that's kind of cute. But yeah, um, what's this? Bring to me the repenting patriot. Let me then shut the door open. Well, he's right here, but whatever. That's a mo that's a star door. So, uh, star doors are, yeah, those are like mini stories. But, uh, so, how the story started is that we were all in our own separate cages, and... Kind of, where? Wasn't there, like, a locked door? Oh, yeah, now I remember. Here we go, here we go. I remember. It was, like, the first door that I literally checked. Yeah. Okay, so, we were all in our own separate cells, and, um, there, like, there's these, like, Three, like group of three kobolds who were going to try and eat us but um, one of my friends had this character who is a Q or whatever you know like those weird 
ghost looking things uh, from Final Fantasy IX. Uh, the thing with the, like a big tongue. Oh, the, yeah, 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 the race. Yeah, that Quinner is. Yeah, he was playing that kind of character. Okay. And he pulled yeah, off such an much. awesome strength um, strength check when he tried to pull up the bench that was uh, properly screwed into the wall and used the bench against one of the kobolds and did such a good, damn good roll on it that the kobold was no longer... Um, a kobold, but just salsa on the floor. Oh, pretty. <laughs> so that was fun. Oh my god, Joshua, you fucking piece of shit. You need to go to training school again. You need to be orphaned again so you can <laughs> be taught by Ouroboros how to <laughs> fight. Mm. Oh god. Okay, here we go. Oh, almost had him. Do it, Richard. There we go. 127. Hey, Timmy! Hey, Timmy! Okay, where are we here? What? I didn't see how much EXP you got. Was it not a lot? It wasn't a whole lot. Alright, I guess you can skip this out. What the fuck? Yeah, there should be another way you can go. Okay, maybe it was just down here then. Or... Okay, yeah, I literally just came here. Okay, okay, okay. I'm slowly losing track of what I was doing because of all the talking I was doing. Okay, here we go. This just is where you're losing the mind as well. Okay, no, let's check around a little more. Oh my god, how far does this go? Oh, hey, what's this? Long Barrel 3. Ooh, a server of tomatoes are people. I think that the other chest there is a key. I think. I'm definitely gonna try and look, so. Yeah, you have to stay on this floor, so you don't go up the stairs. Yeah, I know. This way. Here we go. Wind gem. Oh. Yeah. Did you hear about the two right races in high the school? Stairs. They went to Shining Prom together. Huh. Yeah. It's like a joke that you find in a Christmas cracker. Okay, or like a. Uh, I don't know. Like a. Chocolate bones. Ah, my vocal instructor told me I should use my chest voice more often. Because he's a chest. <laughs> She's crazy. <laughs> nope. Jesus Christ! How many, how many fucking more doors? Oh I think God. this is progress. <laughs> One cannot simply walk into more door, but I'm simply walking into more doors. Yeah, this is like some madhouse. Jesus Christ! Do you think the actual fortress is like this, or is it just fan like phantasma made? Is it like just getting darker the further I get in here? Jesus Christ! You're, you're, this is progress, I think. You have to go back for the key. I know. Okay, yeah, here we go. Thank God, it's finally a fucking dead end. I literally kept going through the first door I see. Oh my God, thank God. Okay, this better be a dead end. Oh, thank God. Now that I'm empty, have you considered depositing all your mirror inside? Uh, I think I have more mirror than you can hold. Mirror. Yeah. Chest charm. Ooh, nice. This chest is covered with a thick layer of fucky smelling mildew. Crest charm. 
you're going to wear the chest crest charm anyway, aren't you? The chest chrome. Curia bomb. You know what the song I have stuck in my head? Neither do I. What song do you have stuck in your head? Ooh, yes. This chest contains the meaning of life. <laughs> Absolutely nothing! Okay. I'm s slowly starting to lose all possible doors I've not been through. No, you have to make a mental map in your brain. I am. Yeah. That's See, fine. there you go. I've been through all those doors over there. Nice. Yep. More. I should have listened to my parents and become a cupboard instead. <laughs> Celestial bomb. This chest is empty, but it smells pleasantly minty. I know my roommate wouldn't like that. He doesn't like mint. What? Yeah, he do he doesn't have um. Not only does he have doesn't have like a good nose. Um. Oh god, that's weird. Um. He doesn't like mint that's either. Okay. But it's fine. He that is for you. Don't need to judge him for not liking mint. Fine, I take it. I don't him right now. Oh shush. He doesn't. He doesn't deserve it. Mint is universally pleasant in the mouth. It is. And it is very nice and pleasant. Speaking of, help me. I should have some tea after. So what does he use for toothpaste? Uh, he uses cinnamon. Oh god. Which I do too, but. I mean, not can, now, can but... Can you taste a cinnamon in your mouth before you can just speak? I think... I didn't even know that was a thing. What, cinnamon toothpaste? Yeah. It sounds insanely American. I... <laughs> They're gonna call out with guess fucking, so. like... Cap Captain Crunch flavored toothpaste. Didn't I just come through here? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I went through here. Fruit Loops and Toothpaste. Ah, oh, shit. No, you were, in, you were in the right place. I was? Yeah. Sh shit, alright. Where the locked door was. Root Beer Flavored Mouthwash. No. Yeah, yeah here it is. This is it. This is it. There we go. You're gonna fire box? Here yep. we go. And then there's a sh very short area after this boss. Don't know if it sounds awesome or bizarre or both. Oh wait, what's this? I've never seen cinnamon toothpaste before. Yeah, just look it up. It's not bad. I mean, I I totally enjoy it. And there's definitely <laughs> one. There's definitely brands of toothpaste that are like spicier than the other. <laughs> so, what items what? should I have for this fight? I think it uses, it, it inflicts force as well. Poison? Force. I mean, I think, sorry. Faint? I don't know why I was saying force. <laughs> Are you, have mm. you been playing SMT too often? No. I'm not playing anything. Alright, uh... Sleep and faint. Oh, that's actually, ooh, that's actually pretty good. But let's see here. All right, is this like the last motherfucker? No, there's one more after this. What time do you call this? You're late, all of you. You're is late. It, is it the old guy? Yeah, it's General Morgan. Yeah, that's the only one. Else, that's the only other person I could have thought of. What does it mean of all this? Get dragged here by some bizarre mask of them. Should revolt my free will. Being used like some sort of puppet. <laughs> I've never been so damn inferior in all my years. Well, he definitely, definitely has that mad rage. Old man rage. Yep. Uh, it's impressive vocal cords. It's Joshua Bright. Have you been faring on your journey? Are you still doing well? Oh, that's sweet of him. Still gonna help too. Past my prime. Well, yeah, you got fucking gold hair. You're like 30 years old. <laughs> mm. <laughs> uh, I plenty want to say to you about like. Mm, I'm not sure I'm the best person to. Regardless, always enough talk, talking. There's no avoiding this fight, but we can.